So this lesson is on finding the general rule for a pattern if I'm given either pictures or if I'm given a table of values. <coughs> so remember the first step is always create a table of values from pictures, if I have pictures. If I don't have pictures and I'm given a table, then half of your work is already done. So first you create your table of values. So here we have our table of values. It starts with 8 as the first term number, 15 as the second term number, and 22 as the third term number. The second step after you've created the table of values is look for the down rule, which basically means how much does it go up or down by every term number. So if I look at this and I go from 8 to 15, 15 to 22, I can see it goes up by 7 every term number. I could also draw this on uh, my number line. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 15. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. So if I continue the pattern, I know I go up by sevens every time. So I know my next number will be 29 of my pattern. This is all right, but what if I wanted to know figure 101? I'd have to continue this pattern for a very long time to figure that out. So I need to try to find the general rule. So the way that I do that is I use the down rule, the plus seven, and I know that I put this uh, as part of my coefficient. So the down rule becomes the coefficient of my algebraic expression. So my term value will be 7 times the figure number because it goes up by 7 each time. So every time I go up a figure number, I go up by 7. If I went up by 5 each time, it would be 5n. If I went up by 10 each time, it would be 10n. So I have to see how much it goes up each time. Now if I try this for the first value, 1 times 7, I can see for the first value, if n equals 1, then term value is term value is 7 times 1 equals 7. But that doesn't match my answer. My answer is 8. So I have to try to come up with a fix. And the fix is what we call a constant. So I add or I subtract a constant to fix for the answer. So my answer was 7, sorry, my, the one that I got was 7, but the answer I want is 8. So the fix, or the constant I have to do, is I have to add 1. So then to this, I have to add 1 for my rule. So I propose my rule is term value equals 7n plus my fix, which is the 1. So let's try that. For number 2, I will multiply by 7 and add 1. 2 times 7 is 14 plus 1 is 15. So that works. Let's see if it works for term 3. 3 times 7 plus 1 is 22 and 4 times 7 plus 1 is 29. I can continue the pattern for term 5. So 5 times 7 plus 1 is 36. 15 times 7 plus 1. I'll have to use my calculator or I can do mental math. So this is 105 plus 1 is 106. And 101 times 7 plus 1 is 707 plus 1 is 708. You can see that it's much faster to do this with a rule than to continue the pattern. So for any figure n, my general rule will be 7n plus 1.